Never forget how your friends are. If you are starting to get more fame, never forget how your true friends are. People were, who were talking to you. The people that want to be in your company. When you are, did that never. When you are was one nuisance, never forget them. Always be there for them. The ones that are supporting you. Even when you are be totally a nuisance. Even if you lose all your fame, if you lose all your money, forget nothing how your friends are. Because those who are standing near you, there will be there for you when you are in your darkest time. And therefore, you shall never ignore them. And we shall help them. When you are of more, so you can be together, a stronger team, if they want to be a part of your team. Never become arrogant. Never get the idea that just because you have a bit of luck, that you have got a lot of money, that you have got a lot of influence in the world, that you are be better than your former friend, or the friends of you that are knowing that, that they are just not in the popularity zone like you. If they are also become, I want to become famous, you can help them. And also learn them the lesson that they can better be with the, that the true friends, the only friends are the ones that are near them. Even if somebody, if anybody don't uh, follow you anymore. They stand on your side. They have your turn. And they will help you. Instead of that, they think... Like, uh, instead that they learn to think like the majority of the people who are getting famous and become a parasite. I think they're... Just because they are famous are more important than the middleman or the man on the bottom of the economical system, or must I say called. Because that's a bliss we are living in. Never become your enemy when you are, did have nothing. Also. Not be like Stalin, how in order to dethrone the Tsars, the Tsar Dynasty becomes even worse than the Chinese of um, where we never become we like the fathers of the Americans how in order to free themselves from the English become worse than the English and they have longer significant longer slave trade also how we're so arrogant to don't want to pay the English back for for the English helping uh, them to defense against the French. Yes, now you know a bit about the American Revolution. Why they want to be free from the English. Because they don't want to pay the English back for helping them. Instead, they want to become an all nation. Instead of a colony of criminals. How the English don't want to have in their land. Just like with the Australians. Any country have its flaws, any country have its wrongs. There is not one person on the planet. How is not, have never been one 
person in his ancestral lineries how is not be a king or a slave in the Arab world whites and Hindus were slaves in the Americans black people were slaves and Native Americans and also some Irish people everywhere have been slaves and stop walking around the subject by saying now there are domestic servants domestic servant is another word for slave stop stop playing euphemism games people it is as and I if you are on the top of the society you should not watch down you should watch watch yourself you have to be critic all on your own because now I say you this this will have a finite risk finite resources it means there is a limit in grow there's a limited amount of money you can suck from places in reality in contrary with the economical I'm insane system that's how I call them money system because actually the, mo the banks are printing money anytime you go to the bank the bank will actually clone your money and then they put IOUs in place of it so what you actually do if you go to the bank and you have a 10% or so for them they're actually making up if you give them hundred dollars they make up ninety dollars from nothing that's the bull crap life of a bank bankster uh, the most biggest Ponty scheme artists on the planet. In some cases, they have no percent reserve, and they're actually they produce 100. So in theory, anytime you go to buy some stuff, for example, let me do it with five people. We have a one dollar in the one real dollar. Then the one person buys something with a with that dollar from somebody then it goes to the bank the bank creates another dollar if you have no percent reserve and then they go to the next one and then you have three and then if you are back by the first then you have uh, five have created five dollars because ponty scheme ever big experiment scheme eliminati <laughs> If you want to talk about it. But furthermore, if you are not the victim, don't mention it entirely from your point of view, so I said it before. Because if you are the king, if you are the queen, if you are the vandal, if you are the capitalists, it is pretty easy to mock your victims, make fun of their entire existence, label them stupid and dirty, say that their life don't matter at all, that they have to prove to you why you should be kind to them. And I can say, oh they are too stupid and therefore they deserve it. But when you are the victim or speak up for the victims, positions are don't seem to look like anymore like that. Your privileged brats. The capitalists think the whole world needs to worship them because there are a lot of money. The capitalists think that our system is so great. When in reality, their system is not. Capitalist Nigeria, the Libya, and the Republic of Niger, all all capitalist country all all poor i can also in the united states just three billionaires of as much wealth as the poorest 50 percent of the united states 
So what a joke. And the environment is also suffering because of uh, greed, supply and demand. We should put that system on cages because our species is not more important than the other earthlings on this planet. And we should actually live in harmony and not that supply and demand capitalist mania actually gratify all our gluttony and all our greed. Because the economical system is far inferior subjective and totally worthless in comparison to the ecology of this world. We don't can live without phytoplankton. Phytoplankton can live without us. We don't can live without pollinators like bees and butterflies. But they can easily live without us. We cannot live without bacteria. We cannot live without them because our bodies exist for around the health or something like that or more. Oh, the bacteria! They synthesize our vitamins and minerals also. I hope to digest our food. For example, uh, melanobacteria bacteria are creating many types of B vitamins for us and also vitamin K from fiber and so I can also uh, say what they are also do but we have in our gut for example in our gut around thousand types of bacteria our body exists out of um, 40 trillion bacteria cells and around 30 trillion so called human slash hominid cells. So do the math. We are a symbiote, we are not individual. An individual exists just like one organism, so the there are very little to know, specifically not larger organisms, how are an individual. And we have to stop with this, I'm an individual mindset, because you are not. Microbes, bacteria, the smallest kind of bacteria, one cell organisms. There are an individual. You're not. You're a symbiote. Because that's what a symbiote is. An organism that exists out of many organisms. But working together. Making it well. Kabam. Just like with society. Without the lower class workers of the society, all your rich people, all our famous of money, you will not have that. Because the system, like it now works, is a pyramid scheme. With the lower workers that all the society going on, on the bottom. Then you'll have them then the police force and the military people or the farmers depending what kind of system you have then you have the actors Hollywood scammers politicians CEOs of businesses and bankers and animal agriculture also have a lot of power in our pyramid scheme that we call capitalism, that or that we call feudalism, or that we call uh, fake socialism, like they have um, fake communism that they have in um, China, which I call fascism because it sounds more like the idea of fascism, and 
system and any cooperation is connected to the government but it is also a pyramid scheme because you have the, the money is not spread around the people because just like in the US the, Chi the, the Republic of China have a pyramid model you have rich a large extremely rich people there and you have extremely sh living on a house with four families poor people you not can imagine if you come from the US so poor I am for sure but there also have um, billionaires and people out I have um, a large um, cars have large houses think about it be a person of fun instead of a person of success being a person that stands for something instead of a person who only wakes with the waves of the money flow or would be famous or would be popular be a person with a backbone don't be in a spineless a little brand grow up